I haven't ridden this thing in a while. Pull up right here, next to the beautiful Raider. Hey, que paso amigos, John's Moto Garage. Welcome to the channel, gracias for checking it out. If you haven't already, be sure to smash the like button and subscribe, leave a comment below. It helps out the channel tremendously and I appreciate all the support. As you can see, we got a couple of the bikes out here. We got the Goldwing F6B, this is a 2013. We've got the Sporty, it's a 2012 883. I did a video kind of doing a more or less comparison of this and the Yamaha Bolt. This is a 2015 Bolt C-Spec Cafe Racer, fun bike. Um, but today we're gonna be talking a little bit about this 2018 Harley Davidson Fat Bob. If you haven't already, check out the video where I actually pick up the bike. This is a spare, I actually never used that. What I'm curious to see is how she rides. I think I do a ride and review, and I also do a walk around cold start on the motorcycle. And I even learned how to do, sorry, my kid's back here. I even learned how to do knee drags on this bike. So check out all those videos if you dig the fat bob. What I haven't done is a price reveal. So I bought this bike used, I found it on Craigslist. And some of the bikes I buy and I keep and I ride around a little bit until I get bored of them. This one I bought with the intent to, to sell it, knowing that I was getting a pretty good deal. It would be an awesome bike to keep. I just, I can't justify having that much money tied up in a motorcycle when I can get other ones for much cheaper. Today we're going to do the price reveal on this moto, a little walk around and I'll go over how much I paid for the bike. So again, 2018 Harley Fat Bob, 107 cubic inch, completely redesigned. I love these bikes. It's really grown on me. I dig the aggressive look. I dig the, the vivid gloss black, the drag bars, super fun bike to ride. I think Harley made all the right improvements. It's faster, it's smoother. It's more nimble, easier to throw around. So good job. Hats off to Harley on this bike. This is your stock exhaust. This is the 107. Nice little close up there. Now the reason I'm doing this walk around is because I actually got a deposit on the bike. So it should be sold here within the week. And by the time you're watching this, that means everything uh, went as planned. Get a close up on the tank here. This has a proximity key. I'll have to go grab the key. I don't have it on me at the second. Uh, a little bit dusty, I apologize, but belt drive. You got the mid controls, the chopped rear fender, side mounted plate, big exposed fatty rear tire. beefy front tire just an awesome motorcycle looks wise stacked up to any of the other bikes I got in the garage this is one of the coolest looking motorcycles what's up dude what's up buddy the little guy hasn't been feeling too too hot all right sorry about that we're back so I got the proximity key there you have it you just have to have it on your person and it'll start the bike up so let's go ahead and start it up real quick Oops. Eight hundred forty-four miles. This thing's barely broken in. All stock except he flipped the mirrors. The stock exhaust is not like super loud. You got adjustable suspension there. They came with those on the soft tails. All right, you guys, so now to the big 
question, how much did I pay for the motorcycle? I'll post KBB and because these things I think retail from like 17, 18, then after taxes and everything, you're probably paying close to 20,000 out the door. I found it on OfferUp, the guy, or sorry, on Craigslist. From the original owner, he had it listed for 12, or initially 13,500. And he then ended up dropping it within a couple days down to 12,5. And that's when I messaged him and I offered him, I think 11,000 initially. And we ended up agreeing on 11,500. So that's what I paid for the bike, 11,500 bucks. Let me know below, you think that's a good deal? 2018 Fat Bob, 107 cubic inch, 844 miles, clean title of course, never been down or dropped. What do you guys think? Um, 11,500 bucks for this bike, is it worth it? You think I got a good deal? Would you spend that kind of money on this motorcycle? Now that's what I was saying, personally, I don't like to have that much money tied up in a moto, it's a toy, and you can get nice bikes at a fraction of the cost. For example, take a look at the Yamaha Bolt over here. We'll do a comparison video of these two at some point as well. This bike I picked up for 3800 bucks. 2015, it's got 12,000 miles, so $3,800, $11,500, you know, big difference. But the value is there for sure on these. They are dope motorcycles. And I think Harley did an awesome job. Super fast, super smooth. Fun bike to ride, absolutely. So that's what, uh, yeah. So that's the uh, story behind this one. 11,500 bucks on the 2018 Harley Fat Bob. All right, you guys, John's Moto Garage. Hope you enjoyed the content. Check out the other videos. I do the knee drags, rides. Uh, Got my supermoto, learning wheelies on that, the Honda Grom, everything motorcycles. We just try to have fun on the channel. If you dig the content, like, subscribe, and hit me up on the next one. Sorry, it's a little bit dusty. One final walk around on the beautiful bike. Adios.